We will go to the hospital as soon as you finish your breakfast. I hope Pandey is all right. I wonder how he got cancer. Every day, millions of people poison themselves with a lethal substance called tobacco. They use it either in the form of BDs and cigarettes, chew it raw, or mix it in pan. How are you feeling, Pandey? I hope you're better now. How did all this happen? I ignored a white patch in my mouth which grew into a lump. My cancer was caused by my constant beery smoking. If I had known earlier, I would have surely stopped using it. Most patients in this ward have got cancer due to tobacco use. Matthew, that young fellow there, was a chain smoker. Now he's got lung cancer. Pavar was a regular beady smoker. His voice box was removed yesterday. Kamle started chewing tobacco when he was 14. At 43, he's got lip cancer. Shah had cancer of the inner cheek. Luckily, he was operated in time. And that's Rathod. He had cancer of the trachea. How I wish I had never smoked. But at that time, I didn't know that tobacco causes cancer. How many more days will you be here? Are you going to have an operation? At the rate you're eating these tobacco pans, you may have to have an operation yourself. You'd better be careful, or even you'll end up in this hospital. Look, just to be on the safe side, why don't you go for a cancer checkup? I'll think about it. Okay. I better be going. I'll come again after a few days. Okay. But remember the checkup. Three out of every four people who suffer from oral or lung cancer are users of tobacco. What is even more significant is that most of these people need not have suffered at all had they stopped using it. Come in. Please be seated. I'm Ramohan Sharma. My son Ashok. I've come for a checkup. I'm glad you've come. There are some people who don't come for a checkup because they're too scared. But what they don't realize is the fact that a checkup is so simple and so easy to perform that there's nothing to worry about. But doctor, how can cancer affect me? Let's take an example. Do you use tobacco? Mm -hmm. A person who uses tobacco regularly is asking for trouble. There are people who know that tobacco causes cancer but choose to ignore this fact. There are others who don't even know the harm that tobacco causes. You won't believe it. But cancer hospitals are full of patients suffering from tobacco-related cancer. Can a young person get cancer? People who smoke cigarettes, BDs, chew tobacco pan, or use tobacco in any other form are more vulnerable to oral, throat and lung cancer. Tobacco definitely increases the chances of getting cancer. There's no doubt that people who do not use it are healthier and live longer. 
Where does cancer usually strike tobacco users? In the mouth and the lungs. In the mouth, it could be the lip, the tongue, the throat, the floor of the mouth, and the pharynx. In the lungs, it usually begins at the bronchi and spreads to the other areas. Is there any warning or indication? Yes, the body gives certain warning signals which are very easy to recognize. For oral cancer, the warning signals are a swelling or lump anywhere in the throat, a sore throat that does not heal, white patches in the mouth, difficulty in swallowing or talking, restricted mouth movements, hoarseness or change in voice. For lung cancer, the symptoms are quite different but just as easy to detect. Blood specked saliva, a persistent cough, chest pain. If these signs are present, it is sensible to go for a checkup immediately. This simple half an hour checkup involves an ear, nose, and throat test. A blood test, a blood pressure test, and an x-ray. All you have to do is go for a checkup once a year. Because the sooner a cancer is detected, the faster it can be cured. Two people now realize that tobacco slowly destroys. So, the next time you feel the urge, remember, you're not reaching for tobacco, you're reaching for cancer.